Welcome everyone, the end is nigh, is out today, and it just got released, I wanted to play it as soon as possible, um, even though I have to go to work here in an hour, so I'm going to play for a little bit, um, get the game out there a little bit, see some, uh, so you people can see some footage of it, and uh, unfortunately I'll have to end in about an hour and head off to work, and then play all night long. So, just downloaded it, haven't played it yet, uh, let's just get right in here see what this game is all about so okay we'll pick our save file here ash dies alone live so i think this is kind of in the okay, trailer we're going to load up one of my favorite games here uh, yeah. here we have uh, the end is nigh it's a classic old school platforming you game just do my intro for me one of my favorites one of my favorite games you got your classic controls got your jumping yeah. Got you going left and right, and like always in these games, yes, nice classic the music. Oh, so I'm playing. Okay. Ooh. What? All right. Oh, well, yeah. that went well. Oh no! 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 <laughs> no! Oh fuck! Oh uh, fuck! Oh god! No, this can't be broke. Here, let me get the <laughs> cartridge out. <sighs> so I hope the audio levels are okay on this. Uh, if they're not, let me know. Oh no! I didn't do it's a whole lot of working. testing. Oh, sorry, fuck. before streaming. Fuck. What am I gonna do? Fuck! But I just have a, just have my audio levels on my normal levels that I do for for streaming and recording. So, hopefully this is okay for you. If it's not, let me know. Dear, anybody reading this, I'm probably dead. That wouldn't be surprising. Everybody else is. There was some kind of apocalypse, and, and all that was left was me. Well, little, little well, story intro. Most of me. All in all, you know. Hasn't been so bad. Till yesterday. My favorite game cartridge finally broke. Oh no. I think I'm gonna go out and make a friend. <laughs> I'll have to go out there. <clears throat> I do love the, the art style Inside. that Edmund has. It's a um, dangerous a twisted place. Super Meat Boy Death and Isaac. And and Gish, basement, uh, basement collection, all that good stuff. You know what? Imagine all the fun we'll have, me and my friend, you know? Be collecting tumors, spinning teeth for distance. Yeah, you know, if I do it right. A lot more, the world. a lot more story than I thought. Won't be easy. <laughs> I'm sure the story I won't matter here in a left minute. Loose, except my other eye. Oh well. Fuck it. Move this guy a little bit up here. All right. All right, we're in control now. Choose a cart. We don't have any carts yet. Okay. Why does it keep doing that? Oh, when you do, when you press up, it does that too. Can we reach up here? Uh, not quite. I don't know if we can wall jump. We can't wall jump, doesn't seem. So, we'll go and search for pieces. Hey, we got a piece. But I, but I took it already. Can I give it to you? That's not. <clears throat> so these little hooks here we can hang on to. So hoping we could wall jump. Wait, did we? I guess if we grab the corner we can wall jump. I missed you. Go. There we go. Oh, didn't see those down there. What are you telling me here? Pull-out method, eh? I gotcha. Wait, but how did this... There we go. Whoops! Oh, 
All right. We've only died a couple times. Not too bad. Probably not supposed to die at all in the tutorial, but that's okay. So are we getting bigger with each one we get? Not quite far enough. There we go. Oh no, it's sinking. I'll let this one sink a bit. Make this jump. Uh, I'm not sure we can get up there right now. Yeah, we have to go this way. Quickly, quickly, quickly. How we get that guy? Uh, we goofed it. No, we didn't. We're good. We're good. We're not good. We're good. So. Seems like there's a lot of stuff I'm potentially missing because I see stuff up above and down below that we don't seem to be able to get to, but I'm thinking we might unlock new abilities later on. Maybe. Get up there. There we go. back that way. I'm not sure if we can get on that little ledge or not. I don't even know if we're supposed to be up here. There we go. <clears throat> Seems to be a secret area of some sorts. We got the question marks in the lower right hand corner. Whew, almost didn't make that. do we do here? There's no way to fly up over that, is there? Oh, there we go. Mega tumor! Five tumors acquired! Sweet! And then we teleport back here. Okay. So yeah, nice little secret area there. Try and get this guy as we're falling. There we go. Run, run, run. Got him the second time. We can't, we can't leave without our tumor. Come on. Let's see, actually. I'm gonna stay up here. Oh, but this guy didn't go down. Okay. I don't know why I can't grab that tumor anymore. Yeah, there's definitely some branching paths that I'm not sure how to access yet. There's a keyhole here. I don't know where we get keys. Maybe find them throughout the levels, a la Super Meat Boy. Hello, Philip. How's it going today? Have you checked out this game yet? Did you play Super Meat Boy? This guy definitely has a Super Meat Boy vibe to it, as far as the controls. I find myself ah, using the analog stick when I should probably be using the D-pad. My hand just naturally gravitates to the analog stick nowadays. Um, help. Whoa, 
we did it. Play Super Meat Boy wasn't very good at it. Yeah, I mean, no one's very good at it at first. Well, maybe. I mean, I seem to be <laughs> doing all right here. Just takes a, just takes some practice. I don't know. We can get that guy somehow. Gotta jump sooner than that, though. They believe pixels. Yeah, Lady Pixels is it's very good. It is harder than Meat Boy. I think. I gave up on that game. On um, man. I might just give up on this tuner tumor. Cause I can't seem to get him without. No, maybe we got it. Did we get it? We got it. Okay. <clears throat> uh they be bleed pixels, I Somewhere level like three, four, or four, two, or something. I don't know. Um, the only thing I remember about it is the uh, the arid flats warp point unlocked. All right. Um, yeah, they be okay. So oh, I can warp back to the end. So it shows me little dots here. I guess those are the tumors I've collected. What's up, Wasilla Cubes? How's it going? Thanks for checking in with the stream. Um, I guess the circle on the bottom is the one secret area we found, maybe? And then the dots are the tumors in each little area. So, but yeah, they, they Bleed Pixels was uh, quite tough. The, the part where I gave up, there was a level that had... All I remember, it was a... Like a tower you had to scale that had spinning blades on each side. And so, I mean, you had to time it all right, and it was just. It's not easy. And spent a lot of time frustrated on that level, and never got through it, and eventually just, just gave up on it entirely. He looks like it. Yeah, a little bit. You don't mind just a second. I'm just going to. Turn my volume down. Maybe. Nah, we're alright. We're good. Okay. You just did that tower? Yeah, I... I struggled on that tower. I could not get past it. Whoa! You did it. I think I, like, got past it once, but didn't get a save point. What is, who is this? Would you like to see your fate? Uh, my fate is dying? 50 lifetimes of suffering. Please return when your tumor has grown. So when I have 50 tumors, I can go here, I guess. The tumors are in the upper left-hand corner. Alright. Yeah, I think I got that got past that tower and then uh, died short thereafter a couple times and just that was that was kind of it for me. Maybe a different tower of the place. I mean I don't recall it was a couple years ago. I feel like I had given up and then went back to it at one point and maybe got a little further, but then maybe just ran to another wall somewhere or something. And that's not the way. Oh, I got hooks on the side. I gotta hook onto the side of this guy. There we go. get our tumor and then do it all again. Oh, that won't work. <laughs> right trigger. Okay. I haven't been really paying attention to the instruction blocks around. Oh, right. oh I can get flat? Okay. So this game, I think it's uh, $12.99 or 11 dollars I don't know. I think there was a discount if you pre-purchased it. So I think I got it at 11.99. Uh, I don't know how long it is. I feel like it'll be a relatively short game, but mastering it and finding all the tumors and getting all the secrets might take some time. All right, now we can move on to the next room. Spring. Spring. 
Easy enough. Spring! Too much spring. Ah! Missed him the first time. Alright, what are we doing here? Spring! We can't spring up that high. Oh, what do those guys do? I can't ride those up there, can I? I wouldn't think so. But they're gone now, so we'll move on. Yeah, those look like they hurt. Well, come back here. He just disappeared. There's a little hook over here, so I think we gotta secret area, maybe? Oh. Something that needs a key, which I haven't come across any keys yet. Yeah, I don't have any keys. Uh, <laughs> I was afraid that was going to happen. Just waiting to see exactly when the block went up, and it went up at just the wrong time. Got distracted reading chat. Oh, too fast. Slow it down. Take your time. Take your time. <laughs> you jerk! You gotta be kidding me. I can make it. I think I feel like I can make that jump. But... Hey, there's my tumor. I didn't see ya. Missed you, little guy. Yeah, you won't get me this time. What, what are you? Can I get on your head? Yep. You're gonna send me up to the tumor. There we go. White, but there we go. Now send me up here. Yeah, it's kind of uh, because the kind of not monochromatic, but the limited color palette. It's kind of hard to see some things. I missed. I feel like I've missed a bunch of tumors because. They were just kind of blended into the background. Whoa. This is a tough little bugger. I just skip this one. There we go. Moving on. Maybe. Safe spot. Uh... Okay, that's the same thing I just did. Bombs hard on PC and Switch. Congratulations, good job. But that's not the end. Alright, just gotta be a little patient there. Get our tumor. I I assume there's a tumor in every room. Uh not quite. Oh man. But, I don't know. There's been somewhere I definitely didn't see one, but I think there's a lot of, uh... 
think there's a lot of hidden stuff as far as, you know, pulling down walls and whatnot. I missed my jump button there. Killed Satan on PC. Excellent. Well on your way. Ah, come on. It's gotta be possible. There we go. Just gotta be quick. There he is. Ah. Just gotta, gotta really keep a sharp eye out for him. save file was it from from an update I know sometimes the updates cause some problems with people save files all right good shot Too bad. Ah! I wasn't watching. We stand right. No, we can't get on the edge. Same thing I did before. <laughs> we'll get this. We'll get it. So, I guess the challenge in this game isn't necessarily the levels, because the levels themselves, just a little bit of trial and error. Um, but it's finding all the finding all the tumors in each level and being able to get them and finish the level. That's where the difficulty is going to come from. Um. Oh wait. I'm an idiot. I gotta remember to get out of there and get back on top because I can't finish the level from inside that cube. Hang on the side. Now how do I get back on top? Can't do it here. I guess I just gotta hang out and wait for it to come around all the way again. Kinda, kinda sucks. Maybe there's a better way to do it, but I'm not sure. So we'll just wait here. Take a sip of my beverage. So I'm probably gonna do... I was planning on doing like a Let's Play series of this, but maybe I'll just do the streams. Well, I am still working on that Let's Play for Kindergarten. That I'd like to finish up. Oh, we're not going to be able to... doing that. I know you can jump over it. Get the tumor. Oh, we made it. Overflow. That there is water. Okay. Charge skin looks a good shot. Maybe you should take a dip. You dip. Wow. Okay. This is our warp point. So we can go back. Not doing great on collecting our tumors there. Less than less than half it looks like. What do we got up here? Might just 
Am I just on top of the level? Just jumping? Yeah, okay. So swimming. Okay. Some, some water mechanics. Not a problem. I like his little reflection when you're out of the water. There's a nice little reflection in the water. It's pretty cool. You know, I, I do love 2D, a lot of 2D games, solid 2D platformers and whatnot, and, you know, being a, you're never going to get, like, super, I mean, you can sometimes go super fancy with the graphics, but sometimes it's just the, the little touches that make it stand out a little bit, you know? There we go. Try to jump on his head. <clears throat> nah, I was afraid of that. It, uh, the end of Nye is not in YouTube system yet. And I, I typed end of Nye and hit enter and it auto-suggested Watchmen. And I deleted that and just hit enter on end of Nye again and just was hoping it would just keep the title as is, but I guess it defaulted it back to Watchmen. So I will delete that. Momentarily. There we go. Thanks for letting me know about that. Let's see if we can change that real quick. Game title... Okay. So I think I just removed the title, but I don't think we'll be able to put in this game, unfortunately. Which kind of sucks because people won't be able to find me. What am I doing here? Right in between. Yeah, not yet listed. There we go. Still there? Well, I deleted it. I don't know what else I can do. Games demos. Yeah. It's not a demo though. It's the full game. It just came out, man. I'm struggling with this one here. I gotta get back over here. So I can get on this guy when it is peak. There we go. There we go. All right. So I assume I'll die. Not right away though. So we can go in the water a little bit. Yeah, we have to because there are tumors down there. I'm just checking the game title again real quick. It's 
says all changes saved when I delete the title, but I guess it's lying to me. Back down for the tumor. No, not quite. Sorry for the interruption in the stream there. Ugh. Gotta get out faster. Ah, I'm not gonna do it. I mean, I'm, I'm sure you can get this guy just by swimming, but the timing is just so tight. And you have to get it right down there. Part of the problem is he's bobbing up and down. You have to make sure you time it to where he's bobbing up. We're going to skip him for now so we can figure out a way to go faster. Faster, buddy. Again, we're just leaving the tumor because. Oh, it goes back down. What? What? <laughs> Is this another secret? Yeah, it's a secret area. With these annoying guys. I hate these guys. I'm starting to get a little frustrated. Okay, they're all gonna die in the spikes here. You have to get just right on top of them. Like, even if you, like I feel like I'm touching their top corner, and it still kills me. Since it's only a one-room secret area, it's supposed to be that difficult. So, we're going to leave that too far. I don't like him. I don't want to spend that much time on him. Like, if I hold right and I jump, you always end up hitting the spikes. That's what I keep doing over and over and over again. Miss my jump button there. Guess that's a safer route. Tumor around here. Something in the bottom left, but. Oh, he's in the bottom right. 
feel like, how do you get to that stuff? PS2 at the store, it looks so weird. Why does it look weird? Oh, it opened up for us to be in there. So we gotta leave half the platforms. Or come from the other direction. Just because you haven't seen one in a long time? We can get this guy. Save slot for cartridges. Yeah. Yeah, use memory cards. You had to you had to buy memory cards and multiple memory cards and you only store like so many save files. Didn't have internal hard drive. It was uh back in the good old days. And since they were on discs, they didn't have no discs so you couldn't like save your game on the disc, you know. Oh, so that's not a tumor, that's just a nasty guy. Okay. Never had a PlayStation? Yeah, the PlayStation 1, PlayStation 2, that's uh, that's how it was. Because they're disc they're disc based games that you can't write to, and there's no internal hard drive, so you had to buy those those little memory cards. And they weren't they weren't uh, expensive, but they weren't cheap, you know. Extending this clown, it doesn't dissipate. Mod the PS2 for internal hard drive, yeah. Then you void your warranty and all that stuff. There's a safe spot down in that lower right. You get there for a second, like that. Gonna get on through. Wait. How do we get through that part? Uh, where do we go from here? No, but seriously, where do we go? Can't jump on these guys. Oh, we can jump on those guys. Well, what do you know? didn't do it effectively, but we can do it. You see Xbox Nintendo. Can you not spring off of them? <clears throat> so I have had my first, well, when I was young, young, kind of before, it seems like they're not springy. You can't spring off of them. Yeah, you can. Just gotta do a better job. Uh, so when I was really young, we had an Intellivision. I don't. Know, why is it not bouncing off of him when I go down there? Um, which I I kind of remember playing that, and then uh, I don't understand. I don't understand the mechanics right now. Earlier I sprung off of him just fine, but whenever he's down below there. See, that time it sprung fine, but I was just testing it out and I didn't press a direction. I must be getting my timing off somehow. <clears throat> Had an Intellivision and then uh, 1987, my grandma bought us an NES for Christmas. Well, not, uh, yeah, regular NES. And so, had that, then saved my allowance as a teenager, bought myself a Super Nintendo. The mechanics on these guys are so weird. Like you don't just straight bounce up all the time. And I had PlayStation, Final Fantasy VII, and 
Nintendo 64, PlayStation 2, GameCube. I didn't have the original Xbox, but I have 360. Don't have an Xbox One. Had a Wii for a short time. Um, yeah, uh, the Wii U was the first, first Nintendo console I did not have. I didn't have all the handhelds, but I had a lot of them. But I PlayStation, PlayStation 2, and PlayStation 3 I only had for a little bit, because there wasn't that many games on it that interested me. And I don't have a Switch yet, but <clears throat> probably going to get that because I want to get, get my hands on that Metroid action they got coming out. Sweet, sweet Metroid action. Metroid is one of my favorite series, so... If they can do it right, I'll be pretty excited. I got two more, two new Metroid games coming out. It's like a new Metroid Prime game, and then uh, I don't remember what the other one was now. But either way, I'm just happy they're actually doing something with the franchise and hopefully trying to make good games out of it. I don't like these guys. Surely you can make that. Don't hesitate. Dancing games on the Wii. You know, that was, uh, it brought a new, uh, new group of gamers in. Guy to go back up a little bit. Bounce off his head. Get up here. We gotta grab the tumor and fall to the right. Grab, grab the tumor, fall to the right. There we go. And then slip off the edge. You know, playing, playing Meat Boy, playing this game, it's just, uh, Exercise in patience, patience with yourself, because you are expected to die. I mean, that's, that's, that's how the game is advertised, you know, and you learn from trial and error and muscle memory. Once you figure out how to do it the right way, you just gotta get that muscle memory locked in. When you get frustrated, you just gotta take a second, breathe, refocus. And wipe your palms of sweat once in a while. There we go. Oh no, our tumor went away. Guess we weren't fast enough. And we missed our jump. Let's just die so we can get the tumor. Rubik's Cube's also muscle memory. Uh, yeah, it's part muscle memory, but isn't it part just... I mean, there's actually just a, a series of moves that you're supposed to make. It's like every Rubik's Cube can be solved in X number of moves. I don't know. I've never solved Rubik's Cube myself. But I'm sure if I learned that little algorithm, it's just, it's just a... Part, part muscle memory, but also part just memorization. Knowing, uh... Knowing the right patterns to use. Memorizing them. Yeah, he starts floating up as soon as you get that. Which forces you to go back through this again. I feel like this game does that a lot. It makes you repeat some of the stuff you've already gone through. Which is, I mean, it's fine. It's part of mastering it. it makes sure you master that skill to get through that area. I think I know what we gotta do. 
we got it. Hey. Mm. Oh, there's multiple algorithms for Rubik's Cubes? I thought there was just like one kind of like master algorithm that you could solve any cube with. We did it. That one was a little tough. All we gotta do, just gotta be able to do it. Backwards there. If we had made our way up top, there's probably another secret area, I'm sure. I guess we gotta go swimming, huh? Oh, hey! Jerks. I'm not a fan of these cloud guys. They're annoying and their mechanics are annoying. Swim fast enough. Now I can't seem to get through the water. Yeah, this music is pretty good. Um, at first it was using like tunes I already know, and now it's, it seems to be original music. But you know, it seems to be a... Uh, one of the things I love about Ed McMillan's games is he always has great music in them. And I like his artwork style a lot. I mean, you can tell like this isn't Meat Boy and this isn't Isaac, but it feels like Meat Boy and it feels like Isaac, you know, in terms of art and music and definitely feel. I mean, the controls, the controls feel almost just like Meat Boy. Not quite the same, but pretty darn close. The split. We made it through another world, boys. So, looks like maybe there's 10 worlds total. Cause you got four, maybe, if, maybe 10 or 12 total. It looks like 12. That's 3, 3, 3, 3, 3. Meat Boy wins the friend's house. You should ch check it out. You can uh, wait for a sale to come up, and it's usually like $2.99 when it goes on sale. Like, it's a stupid low price for a fantastic, fantastic game. Um, I want to check something out. Let's go back to our home base. Can we do anything here now? No. So those are probably like super secret areas. Oh, we can't get back up there now to warp, can we? Please? Please? Map? Oh, okay. Hey, guy. How's it going? 300? I only got 46. All right, back to the split. Let's find out what this place is all about. After we finish the split, I might have to end the stream at that point, unfortunately. I do have real life, I have a job. Okay, there's our first cartridge. Well, that's not what I wanted. Just die. Bounce off this guy. Bounce off this guy. Alright. Get right back up there. So there are invisible walls then. Or, yeah, 
acid. Oh. I didn't see the cloud there. That's what's going on. Again, you know, the... The color scheme in this game makes it a little hard to notice some things. Cart acquired. Play on your home console. Alright, I want to go back to home now. Let's play out this... Let's play this game. Why is your home called the end? River City Rancid. Achievements. Bare minimum. Beat the game. Half empty. Beat the game. 50 rings. Beat the game without continuing. Beat the game. 100 rings. Okay. Let's try it out. So I guess this is like, uh, this is like Super Meat Boy, the, the retro levels. I'm assuming this is safe water. Looks to be. No timer, doesn't look like. We got nine lives. Nine lives, like the dead cat. I want to get that ring before hopping over. Okay. I'm assuming like the normal game, we'll just start over each room if we die. Hello? Oh. I was there in the bottom left corner, he just couldn't see me because of the CRT warping effect. There's probably something up top there. Maybe not. I don't seem to be able to get to it. Gotta go. Alright, thanks for coming by, Ocilla Cubes. We'll see you later on. Oh, I missed a ring. I don't think I can get those either. I gotta watch my lives. Hmm. Oh, I can get on this edge here. There we go. Well, I got him, but it cost me a life. Oh, no, I'm gonna lose this game. done this. I just forgot. More good music. Alright. Uh, yeah. We got one continue. Alright, so we really get 18 tries at this. I don't know if you can earn extra lives in these little retro bonus levels. Okay, well... Okay. I guess I didn't realize that the green was... What? Oh, is the... Is the air poisonous? Okay, the air is poisonous. I guess it's a green cloud. This is so... Okay, well, we're done with that for now. Uh, yeah, I don't really... That's, that's my only complaint about this game so far, is the, the color scheme being difficult to see certain certain hazards in certain places of interest. So we can go down or we can go up. I'm gonna go up. I assume we can go to the side too, but I don't know how yet. Okay, so split is just a, just a little area to branch off into two different areas. Three different areas, probably. Just can't get to the right. Come on. And now I'm just missing jumps terribly. There we go. Okay, Mr. Tumor. Miss some more jumps. Or not. Pop 
face off? Yeah. Okay, I gotta jump off the hook there. No! So it goes all the way out, jump off the hook. Nope, that's not it either. Gotta do this. There we go. Can we make it back? I was just looking at the moving spikes. I'm looking at the spikes just chilling on the ground. Dummy. Didn't quite squeeze through there. Didn't quite squeeze through there. I know we can make it. We did it before. I really do like tight design like that. It's like there's only a small frame where you can make a jump. I don't want it to be pixel perfect, but I want it to be like pretty tight. Um, let's go up. We'll probably die if we go to the right. We have to jump on these guys. Oh, we jump on the clouds. Okay. Can't get any extra height off the clouds. Doesn't seem to be. Um, oh, we gotta go down. Through. Just jump this time. There we go. Just jumped a little too early last time. Oh man, that's okay. We got it. We know what we're doing. All right. I we'll just uh. I just wanted to test the gravity on this section. Make sure it behaved the same as the others. It did. How do we get him? Oh, we gotta take a ride of cloud down. Whee! 
Help. Don't you ever dive at me again. Gotta use you to get our tumor, though. How do you how do you bait him into position? There we go. Now I just gotta survive. And do it all over again. Seems to be the theme of this game. Ah, you son of a bitch. Oh man, you got me. You got me good. Dip, dive, dodge, duck and dive. I think after this room, I think I'm going to have to wrap it up. I do appreciate those of you who tuned in or those of you watching the video. Uh, I do plan to keep playing this game, show off more of it. So if you're enjoying it and if you're enjoying me, please like, please subscribe. Please keep watching my videos. Help me grow bigger so I can keep doing this more and more. I want to play games with you guys and hang out. Why? I got that perfectly the first time, and now I can't get it again. But yeah, please, please, if you're enjoying this, please subscribe to me, like the video, all that stuff, blah, 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 promote myself, all that stuff you guys hate. Smash that like button. We're going to get 10,000 likes. You know, that kind of thing. Um, it, but it does help. It does help for, especially for this a small guy. If I can get some engagement and start showing up in people's searches, you know, that's what I need. We're, we'll, we'll get it this time. We got this. We got this. Let's get those damn birds. Birds are assholes. Just like in every game. Alright. So I really hope that this auto saves. It, I'm sure it does. It feels like it does. So we are going to end this here. Um, again, thanks for tuning in. Check out this game. It's, it's definitely fun. If you like Super Meat Boy, you will like this game. Uh, so go out and buy it. Uh, appreciate you being here. And we'll see ya around.